you're going to take that. <laughs> Where does it get? It's like it disappears. <laughs> That'd be the last time I got me a dress made out of cheesecloth. <laughs> Watch out, he'll turn into the Janet Jackson show. Oh. <laughs> We've had dresses like that before. <laughs> I'm with you. Oh, yeah. We're going to take a little break. We invite you to uh, what we call our Bluegrass Boutique. Uh, you'll find a lot of the music. Mickey has CDs. One of them has the song that uh, was made famous by Gene Watson. Farewell Party. Uh, Aaron, you might have seen him on The Voice. He performed with a couple of artists. Wrote a song called All About the Banjo. He has a, a project with that title on it. I got to sing a song on that. Hunter has, a, he's got the newest, I guess, besides mine. Uh, Live at the Carter Fold. If you love fiddle music. It has its way more than just a fiddle album. It has a lot of great singing songs. Josh Williams sings three songs. I got to sing a song. Mickey sings a song called Tennessee. So be sure to check that out. And this music is what I see. My latest CD is not only on CD. If you say, I no longer have a CD player at my house, in my car, wherever, we have the answer to that. I bet you've always dreamed of having a mandolin USB drive. And we have it. This latest project is on. It's a replica of my mandolin. So be sure to check that out. And we have a printed schedule, lots of places where we're going to be. Uh, like we're going to be in Knoxville, uh, celebrating the 50th anniversary of Buddy's Barbecue. That's coming up in July, I think July 22nd. And we're in Dollywood, October 24th and 25th, I think, for their Harvest Festival. You never know where we're going to be. Hazard Fest. What to town is that in? Green. Green. How far is that from here? Out, not that far away, huh? So we are going to be in quite a few places. Catch us in Nashville, Tennessee on the 4th of July. It's not that far. We're going to Stanton, Virginia, the home of the Statler Brothers. Their sons are hosting the uh, Happy Birthday America. We're going to be in the parade. Did you know that? Oh. <laughs> See? Look, Hunter just parked right up and he found out he's going to be in a parade. Oh, uh, inside. <laughs> this time is actually one. You have to be in one. Years ago, he was, uh, he was late coming to the Grand Ole Opry, and he called me, he made a wrong turn, and he went down through uh, Chattanooga, you know, down 27, and I said, Now hold on a second, no, wait a minute, they were a bad wreck, and I was trying to avoid this bad wreck. Yeah, and Mickey said, well, get, Mickey said, if you get off the crab tree and go down there about two miles and make another right, and go down there and make a left by the tree, until <laughs> you see three mailboxes, when you see that fourth one, it's turn there too. And anyway, I didn't have a GPS. It was back in the day before we had GPSs and I had an atlas. And my ex-wife didn't know how to read an atlas, okay? So I ended up down in Cleveland, Tennessee in the middle of a parade. I kid you not. I pulled in the parking lot and get in line between two floats and I said, this is not what I need to do. I had no candy to throw out nor did I have anything to eat, so I got to the rest of it. The funniest, he called me, I'm in from Max David Delbury, he said, how far is it from Cleveland to Nashville? I said, about two hours. He said, well, I'll be there in about two hours. I said, where are you now? He said, I'm in a parade. <laughs> <laughs> oh, keeps us laughing. Yes. <laughs> anyway, we'll be back in just a little bit. <laughs> Don't go away, have a refreshment. Take us into the break with a song called Joshua. 